here today I am bringing you a day in the life video um, some of you guys had expressed some interest in seeing what an average day looks like for me so I'm gonna go ahead and take you along today I have two pieces of this bronze white bread or friends however you say it each slice is 40 calories there's the macros uh, there's the ingredients if you want to know I put one tablespoon on each slice of this Crazy Richards. I added some swerve to this because I don't like it as is. Um, I also added some strawberry good goods jam. So that's what I'm going to have for breakfast. And these are the macros for that. So yeah, that's what I'm going to have. So this is the setup I have. I have my numerous notes. I have my TV connected to my laptop. I got a little desk and um, my little chair. This is the view I get a look outside to. It's nice and gloomy today, so sun's starting to come out, but I'm just kind of looking outside and uh, yeah, I'm gonna start my work day. some of my keto sushi um, I posted a recipe recently for that um, I don't have a full roll I think this is a roll minus three of the little pieces but I also have some dipping sauce I was debating whether I wanted to go uh, low calorie or high fat with this because I could have done a sriracha mayo but because my uh, roll is already pretty high in fat, it's 24 grams of fat for the whole roll, um, I decided to go low calorie. So the uh, dipping sauce I'm using is this one. It's pretty much just a soy sauce. I don't really taste a big, big difference, but I'm gonna have this now. It is about 12.30. have half a cup of um, like a Mexican blend cheese with two ounces of um, the pork butt that I had cooked a while back ago. I have it on the scale um, and I zeroed it out. I'm going to add t uh, one serving of this daisy sour cream which will be 30 grams so I'll just squirt that on there. Okay so I have that all spread out and I'm also going to add a little bit of spice. I'm going to have this rotel um, it is zero everything, so I'm gonna put that on there now. Okay, and I mixed the uh, Rotel in and that's what I am working with. So it's um, 420 right now and I'm gonna have this for dinner and then have dessert a little bit later. Hey guys, so um, I'm all done with work. I had my dinner and um, I want to edit today, but um, my boyfriend was up late last night because I was complaining to him about people on YouTube not being supportive of others and, and a bunch of stuff that I really didn't need to be ranting to him about, but I kept um, him up pretty late last night and he had to get up early to drive into work today, so I feel really bad and I just want to do something nice for him and he usually always does the dishes because he gets sick of the dishes being in the sink way sooner than I get tired of dishes being in the sink. So um, since he was up late last night, I'm gonna try and make sure he comes home to a clean kitchen so he doesn't have to worry about dirty dishes or cleaning dishes before he wants to make his dinner. So I'll go ahead and show you the mess of a kitchen that I've made. So just so you guys know, um, I am just a messy person. I grew up in clutter. It doesn't bother me, but um, I'm going to do the dish dishes that are in the sink. There's some dishes that are on the counter, and then there's also um, some pans from our dinner last night. So I'm going to go ahead and do all these dishes so that um, he can come home to a clean kitchen and um, not have to worry about it. Okay guys, 
this is what the kitchen's looking like now. It only took me about 20 minutes, but a lot better. I know he'll appreciate it because, I don't know, this kind of stuff matters to him. doesn't matter to me, obviously. I have a bunch of my stuff all over the place. But um, I left the toaster out because I'm going to use that for dessert. I left this stuff out because I'm going to, I'm probably going to have a little bit of a drink later. Um, and this stuff I'm going to use in my dessert. That stuff I probably don't need out, but I feel like if I put it away, I'm going to like forget that um, I own it. So I like to see it, but I'm weird like that. Anyways, um, oh, and this plate I didn't clean because I'm going to reuse that. I know I'm weird. I, I just, I like to reuse things instead of like just like dirtying a bunch of dishes or like rewashing the same one. It's not dirty. I don't know. My uh, grandma on my dad's side, um, she's since passed, but she used to put like tin foil over her paper, over her plates and things. <laughs> so instead of like washing something, she would just like take off the tin foil and throw it away. I'm not that bad, but um, I'll reuse plates if they're like not disgusting. Fun fact about this toaster. I have had this toaster for 11 years. I think it was like $15 when I bought it uh, when I was 18. And now this side only toasts on these burners. And then this one doesn't toast like all that great. But um, I actually did buy myself a new toaster. And which is huge for me. It was only like $15, $20 maybe. Um, and I still insist on using this. I don't know why. I feel like, oh, it works. I just have to like do cook it twice because only one side will be toasted and then I flip it and then ugh, it's silly. I, uh, I need to just, um, swap out the toasters cause I have a new one and it wasn't that expensive. Like I could swing 10, $15. It's not that big of a deal. Anyways. Fun fact about my good old toaster. Okay, so my boyfriend actually just texted me that he is on his way home. His commute is about an hour. So I think I'm going to edit for about 30 minutes and then uh, cook him up some dinner. I usually don't do this for him. I, it's just because I feel really bad that um, I kept him up last night and he had to go to work, into work. So it's just... It was inconsiderate of me and I didn't realize what time it was so I'm just trying to make his day a little bit easier when he gets home so I don't want you guys thinking like I'm always making dinner for him because I really am not he usually does his own thing and I do my own thing but um, I'm gonna go ahead and edit for about 30 minutes and then I will uh, make s some dinner for him I'll, I'll kind of show you what he eats even though he's kind of like a private person and uh, doesn't want to be on camera or anything but um, I will just show you kind of like what I'll make for him. He's pretty simple when it comes to food. He eats basically the same thing every day. So I will go ahead and, uh, take you with me as I edit. So I actually just remembered I have, uh, a couple things that I need to do unrelated to editing. So for the classes that I'm taking in the fall, they actually start next month and I wasn't able to order one of the books. Um, so I need to see if I can order it now. Um, and then I have a prescription I need to refill because I'm not going to Kaiser. No, thank you. Oh my God, I have to show you my cat. Look at this goofball. He does this all the time. He's so funny. Ninja. Ninja. out so I am going to hopefully finish up editing um, my what's it called Q&A part 2 video um, it was actually a lot of fun to record and I'm really excited for you guys to see it so I'm gonna go ahead and work on this for a little bit before I make uh, my boyfriend dinner Okay, so uh, it's time to start getting my boyfriend's dinner ready. So my boyfriend basically eats two of these veggie grillers. That's the macros on them. I mean, you could definitely uh, eat these while doing keto, but um, obviously one burger is a bit high on carbs. I mean, a beef burger is better. This is actually what I used to eat when I was doing vegetarian keto. So, I mean, you could definitely do it. And he always likes to have some veggies. So, I'll um, 
heat that up for him. And I think I'll add a sauce because he's been saying he's been tired of um, doing the veggies because he usually just puts like some garlic salt on it. But I got the stove going and I'm going to get that ready for him. Okay, so this is what I'm going to give to my boyfriend. He just pulled up in our parking spot. So um, I put a hoisin sauce on the veggies and I put a slice of vegan cheese in between the burgers. Okay, so my boyfriend just finished eating his dinner and he loved it. But um, I'm going to go ahead and have this for dessert. It is uh, some toast with peanut butter and some pure hazelnut spread. Yummy. I have a couple of the cinnamon smart cakes and I put about an ounce of uh, cream cheese icing on top. I wanted to show you guys. So what I do, cause um, I don't like getting a bunch of icing on my nose when I eat a cupcake. So I cut them in hot half and then I make it like a cupcake sandwich. I'll show you what that looks like. Just like that. But it's, I love it way better. It's like a cupcake sandwich, it's perfect but I'm gonna have these and that'll be the last thing I have today. I just ate this bag of chips, 140 calories. This will be the last thing I eat today. Okay guys, so I'm probably just going to watch some TV for the rest of the day and uh, go to bed early, it's already eight. But that's all I have for you in this video. Let me know what you thought of this video in the comment section below. I'd be interested to know um, what you think. I mean, I don't do a whole lot. I work at a desk all day, so I don't know if this was interesting to anybody, but I'd love to know your thoughts. Let me know in the comment section. If you liked this video, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, give it a thumbs down, and I know not to do one again. Thanks!